everyone welcome back to mr possum's adventures and we are playing crazy dino park again today and i decided to do some uh battling i've actually progressed past the um uh versus computer place um and i wasn't doing so great it took me a while um so i'm but somehow i leveled past that so now i am only can uh i can only do basically multiplayer battling so we'll see how we do uh, please don't be a strict judge. I'm not super good at it, but I will show you how it works, what to do. Um, like I said, I don't use too much strategy, so if you have any tips and tricks, I would appreciate them. Drop them in the comments. Um, I'm actually just learned recently about the cards that you can use as special abilities, so I'm super excited for that. So, well, let's get into it, and we'll go step by step. If you enjoy this content, if you enjoy playing with me, or just uh, learning... Um, about some of the games that I'm playing uh, would appreciate a like a comment or a subscribe if you would like to see more so let's look at our battleground so we have a couple of different arenas but from what I understand they're the same um, this arena used to offer other game modes that gave you um, gold and um, gems as prize but I've leveled past that and now I'm in multiplayer. So there's two arenas. I think they're the same. I'm pretty sure it's the same. Okay, it looks the same to me. So anyway, yeah, it is the same because I see the picture. So they've chosen a, I forget the name of this guy for us. And you can change them as far as I understand. Yep, you can change it. So let's go with Gallimimus. And we'll select somebody well let's go with the oviraptor there we go he's nice and beefy lots of eyes and right here below him you see there's special cards place for cards the cards i find in the extra expeditions that are done by helicopters if you're not familiar with it i'll, I'll show you that spot after the battle if you know, then you know. All right, so let's look at our cards. I, like again, again, I haven't done this before, so <laughs> this is gonna be a little ridiculous. Damage to herbivores or damage to carnivores. Well, we don't know what we're fighting against. So extra damage when low XP. I'm gonna pick that one. And let's see what else. Dino HP, we can do a speed boost. Well, that's a good one. We have a lot of dino speed plus 200. Let's do that. So that means that if our speed, as far as I understand, if our speed is higher than our opponents, we get to go first. So in this dino slap fight, um, speed actually does matter. So, well, let's see what we get. Start looking for opponent. Ooh. Oof. I might get my butt kicked. Well, let's see. So the battling is fairly simple. Okay, we do have advantage of first move and higher hit points. But we also have... Okay, so basically the point is to try to click the swords when your timer gets to the green area or the blue. Ooh. That was a bad hit. Let's fortify ourselves with some shields. He might kick our butts, actually. But we're not going to give up. We're not doing so great. Ezra, you're doing quite well, Ezra. Oh, well, there it goes. <laughs> yep, we just kind of farted on him. Ezra versus Stinky Possum, that's us. We're the Stinky Possum, that's okay. Never claim to be great at this. Oh my goodness. Well, Ezra, I feel like you deserve this win. Of course, now we go with perfect. No, all right. As you can see, this is not the best. Aww. Well, we'll cry about it. That's okay. We get 100 gold <laughs> and a defeat. That's all right. It's all good. Should we try again? You'd think that they would... Well, I guess they did match as well. 
we just didn't choose very good dinosaurs. Let's see, we'll go with, mm, let's try our pterodactyl and whatever this thing is. Mm, let's go with, one chance to block damage. Let's go with speed. Damage to herbivores. It's 50-50 chance it'll help, right? See, once you collect select your cards, I guess you can't. Oh, we got a mammoth, so that's a herbivore as far as I know. Oh, my goodness. Liliana from Brazil. Let's see. I think that we can do better. Nope. <laughs> so in this channel, you get to watch me lose a battle after battle. I might have to enlist my son in helping me battle because apparently I don't have very good eye-hand coordination for this. It's just stage fright. It's just, oh, we have a chance, maybe. We got a chance, right? Maybe. Her mammoth, if I'm not mistaken, it's a mammoth, looks much more beefy than my pterodactyl. Oh my gosh, Liliana. You are kicking my stinky possum butt. Oh my goodness. How is she talking? <laughs> well, there you go, kids. Um, we lost both battles, so we're going to bow out gracefully for now. And um, we are with rank number four in, in the very bottom of the pile. That's okay. You know what? I enjoy digging for the fossils, the... Um, battling isn't my thing, just to let you know, if you just started playing, if your dinos lose the battle, it's okay, they don't die, you don't lose your, uh, dinos themselves, the only thing is that they need time to recuperate, so you can't use them in the new battles until that's done, recuperation does take a while, I think like up to eight hours, you see, this dude is hurt, he needs time to heal, he's got little pluses coming out of him, so you can't really hop him. Um, you can hop other guys, and as I showed in my other video, hopping them does generate some extra coinage, so you can't do it when the dinos are recuperating. And that's okay, let them rest. And that's about it. That is our battling. Oh, wow! I don't do it often, I just wanted to show you how it's done. In the beginning stages, you do get, first of all, it is part of your leveling. So you do need to complete some of those objectives, but you also get extra money from it and extra gems. And it's not too bad, but it's really not my favorite thing to do in this game. I just rather mine for, or dig for fossils, assemble my dinos, and collect their poops. All right, what was I gonna show you? I don't remember. I was gonna show you something. In regards to battling, let's see. I don't. Oh, the expeditions. So if you haven't, if you just started playing, you will be getting pieces of maps as you dig through, and you will be able to do these extra expeditions. They cost. This one does not cost gems, but this one, this one does. The one on the top. And the one on the right side also does. And they give you various rewards from bones to money, some of them gems, some of them rare items that you can put in the collection like this and get gems from as well. So 
it's uh, just a little extra way to do income. Oh, another thing that you can do to boost your fighters is you will come across this trampoline and you can select a dino to hop on it for a few hours to get a temporary boost to their stats. While it's hopping, let's say we'll put our, oh, who do we wanna boost? Well, let's, let's boost this guy. So he'll be just bouncing, doing his own thing. You can speed up training or stop training altogether. It takes eight hours to, oh, I didn't know that actually, that you can boost it up by watching a video by one hour. So I wonder if you can shorten it. Um, I'll test it out and see if you can shorten it eight times. I'm sure that there is a maximum that you can do it for. So he's training, once he's done, you just put him back in his cage and you can use him and he'll be beefier than he is now. So there you go. That's battling, um, fun for some. Obviously I'm very bad at it. Let's see, ooh. We're almost done assembling our second robo. Okay, that's it for this video. I will practice on battling and hopefully next time it will not be so embarrassing for me but if you enjoyed this video and want to see other crazy dino park videos uh, walkthroughs any tips and tricks uh, let me know if there's anything specific you would like me to show you definitely drop a comment i would appreciate a like a subscription and take care of yourselves thanks for visiting mr possum adventures uh, playing through crazy dino park see ya bye